Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, the key is me, and I am back again with another video. Y'all, I've been having a hot girl summer, so I've been doing terrible with my posting. Forgive me, y'all. I promise. I'm going to do better. So in this video, as you can see, I will be showing you a quick protective styles that you can achieve for $5. Yes, sis. I only use one pack of hair. I believe right now I saw it for as low as $4.99, $5.99. So yeah, 5 bucks, $6 can get you this look. As you can see, I already slicked my hair back into a ponytail. I use, I'm going to pop up on the screen the products that I use. And then I just went ahead and twisted my hair down and popped the rubber band down to secure my actual bun. So the hair that we're going to be using is going to be the Jamaican Bounce. It is in the color 1B. They have so many different colors, to be honest. Depends on you or whatever color you want to use. Absolutely love this hair in the curl, the spring, and the bounce that it has with the curl, as well as when, you're, when you separate the hair. It's so easy to separate. It's not my first time working with this hair, and I absolutely love it. Now, it does get frizzy, so I'm just going to warn you now, because I know that that's going to be a question that you all might ask. So, I'm just going to go ahead and... For the ponytail, I'm going to crochet around my bun. So I'm not going to crochet in my bun. I'm going to crochet around the bun. And instead of separating the hair, I went ahead and I put the full, the full piece that came off of the track of hair. I went ahead and put the full piece in there. So it does come with 15 pieces. So I went ahead and I put 8 pieces around my bun. Starting from the front, going in a circular motion all the way around. as you can see I did go ahead and start separating the hair just to make it a little bit more fluffier now you can make your bun bigger if you would like but I was cool with the eight pieces because I did want to leave the rest of the hair for the front section of my bang so you're just gonna manipulate the hair until you get it to the way you like it I mean there's no way to do your bun just get it to the way you want it to be so when we get to the bang section in the front I did go ahead and split the hair in about two pieces. Some of them I split in three pieces. It just depends on how big the bundle was that I picked up. And you're just going to go in and crochet it regular. Crochet it regularly. Crochet it the regular way. Clearly I cannot talk. So <laughs> you're going to go ahead and crochet it in your head. And you're just going to tie it once or twice. Now... I, as you can see, I did tie it twice, but then throughout the rest of my head, I did just only tie it once because this hair is a great, it is a great grade of hair as far as the texture go. So you won't really have any problems with the hair coming out. So one time is fine.
of course you are going to cut it to your liking now I suggest that you not pull on the curl while you're cutting because if you pull on the curl you may be cutting more than what you're expecting to curl what you're expecting <laughs> look at me I can't even get my words right you're gonna be cutting more than you're expecting to cut and when the curl bounce back up you're gonna see that it's gonna shrink so you just want to cut it to your liking as you can see I'm gonna show you Yes, girl, I don't beat my face. I'm going to show you uh, a couple ways that you can wear this style. So you can wear it with the bangs in the front. You can switch the bangs over to the side. You can kind of twist this up and pin it towards the back. There's so many different ways that you can rock this style. What I love so much about it is, again, it's a protective style. So you're protecting, the, you're protecting your natural hair as well as saving you a little bit of money. This is such a cute style that you could pretty much dress up or down. And I love it. So if you all are feeling this style as much as I am, go ahead and leave me a comment down in the description box. And thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you could please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video.